shelters. I'm going to look for a shelter. How did you go through Galaxy so fast? Taylor, I put in a lot of hours. I do not need a drop pod. Somebody else is telling me outposts. How far away are you from the center of the galaxy? I'm in the third galaxy. I'm like 170,000 or so. Now you guys are telling me outposts. Is it supposed to be the outposts or is it supposed to be shelters? Steven, top five movies. Uh, Ip Man, Kung Fu Hustle. That's not it. Uh, I think it was one of these. Is it the one on the right? What else? Her favorite movies. Amadeus. Shaolin Soccer. And what's one more that I really like? Maybe uh, maybe Howl's Moving Castle. Skywalker is telling me to look at my email. What's up guys, I'm Stat, and in this video we're going to be focusing on getting Atlas Pass V1, V2, and V3 to get the The first Atlas Pass, you're going to have to randomly find an anomaly as you progress through the game. Those random anomalies uh, occur pretty often, so you should be able to get your Atlas Pass V1 pretty simply. Now, to get Atlas Pass V2 and V3, you're going to need a lot of bypass chips. It's not bad though, because you only need 10 plutonium and 10 iron. Right into this one. After you have a few crafted, you're going to want to find a signal scanner. Those are the things with the big red beams coming out of them. So you're going to want to scan for Colonial Outposts. Yeah, it is Colonial Outposts. You're scanning until you get a bunch of Operation Centers. Once you have a bunch of Operation Centers on the map, go to them one after another, because there's a good chance you will not get an Atlas Pass on the first try. So you need to find an Operation the Center. Operation Centers because you have to break through the door with your multi-tool bolt. So I need specifically an operation center. Terminal and answer the question correctly. It usually helps having uh, learned a bunch of the words from the languages to help understand the question. Because if you make a mistake, that could have been the one that gives you your atlas pass. So you don't want to make mistakes. Eventually, you will get the recipe for the atlas pass V2 or V3. And then you will be able to craft it in your inventory. If you have the atlas pass V3, you will be able to use it to open the Atlas Pass V2 doors as well. As you can see in this clip, I'm going to show you what it felt like for me to get the Atlas Pass V2 in one of my live streams. Check it out. Uh, unknown life form research. Operational outpost. It's a manufacturing facility. That's not what we need. And because we are doing uh, this in segments, what I'm going to be doing is... There we go, we got an operations center. Here we go. 
Operation Center. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hopefully this isn't one that we already found. Where is the entrance to this? Here we go. Let's try this again. We're gonna try uncommon. I retrieve a recipe from the operational facility. And we already know how to do warp cell. We got it right. We just, uh, we didn't get a good reward. Oh, thank you, Tyler. Um, I want to state, though, again, I mentioned this before, that I really appreciate your guys' donations. We already have a couple moderators inside of the Discord, and I'm trying not to get it clustered that much. I don't want people to think that just because you donate that you end up getting a moderator status inside of the Discord. I just feel it makes the Discord look bad when like everybody is becoming moderators. But it's nice seeing you being a part of uh, the live streams and stuff. And Tyler, thank you again. Please everybody do hashtag Tyler Ebby. Then for another moderator. But thank you very, very much, man. I really appreciate your support. Do a dance? <laughs> I could do a little dance. I mean, you already gave a couple bucks so far. Hit the Stevie T. I gotta hit a uh, colonial outpost. We gotta try and find ourselves another one of these locations. And it was not manufacturing a facility, it was uh, an outpost. How far from the center? Like 175,000 or something. And thank you, Scott. Oops, clicked on the wrong button. Everybody please do hashtag Scott Edwards. Inside of the live stream chat, thank you very much for your donation, Scott. And we found an operation center. You guys just gave me some good luck, I think. Maybe this will pay off. Hopefully we'll be able to get our Atlas V2 pass. Over at this one. Uh, the one on the left, it looks like. I'm gonna move back over. That jingle, by the way, is my roommate's cat. And thank you guys for showing support for the people that donated. It's very nice of you guys to do that, and really every single dollar does help me out. Literally, every dollar helps me out. And I've already been here. You know what, guys? I feel like we should go to a different planet. Discord takeover! Takeover! Can I make it? Yes, I can. Steven, say go through the black hole. I love the upgrade to my ship, man. I feel like it turned out so well. Alright, let's try this. Uh, Jebediah Gaming. There should be a button on the live stream chat 
if any of you guys did want to donate at any point in time, I'm not saying you got to do it now. You don't have to do it, period. But because somebody asked in the live stream chat for this, you should see some sort of a dollar symbol. You can click on that. And then I don't know what the next steps are. But if you go to my YouTube page, there should be a button on the side that says support too. And Aiden Shrink, thank you so much for subscribing, man. I'm glad you're having fun. I don't know what time you tuned into the live stream. But this has been a really uh, very silly live stream we've done so far. How many stuff did I just break? I agree, the fire rate on my thing is insane. Well, apparently I'm in a fight now. Thirty-seven ships remaining? You've got to be kidding me. How is there 37 more ships that I have to defeat? I've never seen that. We're going to do it. You know what? Screw it. We're going to do it. We're going to take down all of you. Oh, we're done. What the? No, it says now that there's more. All right, guys, we're going in for an epic space battle. Let's see what we got. That is a lot of green dots. Wish me luck, guys. Engaging with the enemy. So you gotta be really careful because I'm afraid I'm gonna hit the ship. If I hit the major freighter, then for all I know, it's just gonna... They're gonna... Yeah, see, now they're attacking me. Why are you guys attacking me? I'm trying to defend you.
so hard to tell where these guys are. It's like they all should be right in front of me. And then they're not. And then it stops locking onto them. And I'm trying to actually attack them. There we go. Fill this up. Wait for the next person, wait for the next person. more. Wow. one of the few moments where it really helps to have a ton of titanium. So they just ran me? I feel like the phase beam is really good to get in their attention and then you want to switch over your photon cannon if you got it enhanced in there. 
enough. That way then you can really try and take them down as quickly as possible. Yes, we got more gold, which we didn't need. We got this, guys. We only need to get ten more. Oh, Tyler! <laughs> Thank you! Everybody hashtag Tyler Ebby in the chat. And uh, he said, cinnamon. <laughs> 